Hi, I'm Adam with Neil Elfman Service. Uh, just going to go over your tire pressure light information. Basically, whenever the tire pressure light comes on, I'm going to show you how to reset that correctly and the proper pressures that it needs to be set at. Cord model here that's on the dash. Now, sometimes the reset button can be hidden. It's down located lower on the dash here. Um, it's just a reset, very easy. We press this button here and we hold. Basically, once the light starts blinking, we know that it's reset, we release it. And then from there, to do a hard reset, we would mimic the same process, hold it again, and then from there, it would reset all your tire pressures. Now, times your tire pressures can come, come on is whenever um, you have a decrease in 25% of the actual air pressure in it. So we're looking at one to two pounds. There is a recommended uh, tire pressure that's located on the door, and it does show it at cold tire pressure. So when you are driving the vehicle, the tires do heat up, and they can become, you know, um, a decrease in air, air pressure based on with your tire speed and your model. So with that, very easily, you can just press that button, turn it off, and then you can uh, be on your way.